Hello everyone, I have a very exciting package to share with you today. I've just this minute received it and this is from the lovely Michelle Pipling. Um, I will put a link to Michelle's YouTube channel in the description box below. Um, I think her YouTube channel is something like Ribbons, L Roses and Lace or something because she changed her name. So forgive me Michelle but definitely I will put a link to her channel in the description box below. I've just cut it open and um, we were doing a swap this month and I didn't expect this to get here quite so soon. Um, it arrived. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Look at that. Oh, Michelle, that is gorgeous. Oh, my goodness. I haven't even opened it. <laughs> isn't that beautiful? Just let me fold that down. There we go. And hopefully you have a bird's eye view there. Oh, isn't that lovely? It's so delicate. It's so old. It's beautiful, isn't it? And we were swapping. We were swapping a... Now I've got it written down. We were swapping a needle book, a fabric album, and a surprise gift. They were the three things that we were um, swapping. And... Sorry, my daughter's home today her day off so um, and they were the three things that we were we were swapping and Michelle got hers done early and I'm still working on mine Michelle <laughs> I had a busy time but it it'll be the, posted in time so this I think may be oh, look at this I don't know Let's, whoops we're stuck on something there so we'll just we'll just go one thing at a time Oh, isn't that pretty? And if I recall, I saw this on your channel. This needle book. What I'll do is I'll move the box because I just need that little bit of space to be able to look at things. So, there we go. Oh, isn't that pretty? This is the, It's. I remember you doing this or a very similar one on your channel. Oh, don't you just love seeing things in person? And I love this trim. Um, I'm, I'm making a similar one to this myself. I absolutely love that trim. Is that all in one or? Yeah. Oh, it is two. They're joined together. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Oh, it's lovely. And I think it may have been. Well, I won't say. I won't say whether it was a ooh -la -la one or not. Isn't that beautiful? And the little pom pom. So you can see this on her channel and she will be able to describe it perfectly for you. Look at the tiny little thimble charm down the bottom there. And this is the needle book. Oh, isn't it lovely? And there's so much in it. Um, it could have been one of her Just Add Glue episodes. She does a wonderful series called Just Add Glue. Um, where she makes things just adding glue um, with her magical glue gun. Look at that, isn't that sweet? A little pair of scissors. Now, I'm useless at glue guns. I do have one, but it's gathering dust in the cupboard. I just, I don't, I can't use it. I would have to do a comedy of errors if I ever pulled it out on a video. Um, oh, isn't that lovely? Look at that. Oh, that's, is that fabric? Oh, it's on like a piece of vinyl. Oh, doesn't that feel good? And we have some hook and eyes. So she shows you how to make lots of things just using the glue. So if you're interested in that, do go and have a look because she has lots of episodes. Um, and there's a little paper tape measure it's in that little pocket there and some pins. Um, she makes lots of things on those episodes. Oh, look at that. Isn't that nice? I love things like this. I really, really do. And some old needles. Oh, thank you so much, Michelle. Isn't it lovely? And it's, it's almost a Parisian theme, isn't it? 
think, did I see an Eiffel Tower somewhere? No, maybe not. And we have some pretty lace here. Whoops, we have a, a cotton reel and some really pretty lace there. And a tag and a doily. Isn't that an unusual doily? And that's a fabric tag. love the corset. Isn't that unusual? It's got little bubbles on it. It's so, oops, we've got something else snuck in there. Oh, it's a little needle set. Look. Thank you. It's so windy here today. Yesterday was like a summer's day. I not missed anything else, I don't think. Um, Yesterday was like a summer's day and today we had a big storm last night and um, today it's really cold and windy. There we go. And look at all the gorgeous trims she's used on this. It's just layer upon layer. I do love this chul one. I do like that. And then we have our last page. There's so many yummy things in here. Look at this beautiful flower and there's a key. I've probably missed a few things because that's what happens when you first see something. Your eyes are going everywhere. Another fabric um, picture. I think, do I peel the back of that off to use it if I want to, Michelle? You'll have to let me know. This is so similar to that pink fabric that I, oh, I think it is. Ooh, I'll treasure that. Put that in there with that. And a little roughly trim across the top there. Look at this tiny little pocket and there's a little thimble inside of that. Isn't that clever? Oh, that's so sweet. And a needle threader, which is looped on a safety pin. And some flowers and this really pretty fabric on the back there. It's very pretty, isn't it? Oh, that's wonderful. Thank you so much for that, Michelle. Look at this gorgeous ruffly fab. I love that trim. That is so pretty. Thank you so much for that. So, oh, look at the cluster on the front. It's got a sewing machine. Oh, goodness, look at this tiny, weeny little scissors. They're so small. A little spool. And this lovely beaded piece here. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you. So that's the needle book we were making for each other. And then we have uh, we have another item here, and I'm oh look, this is a oh look, isn't that pretty? Hope is the thing. Sorry, my daughter. She's cleaning her room, and she's kind of making a lot of noise. Okay. Hope is the thing with that purchase in. Oh, okay. I can't read that. I must be having a moment in there. And sings the tune without the words and never stops. Sorry. Um, isn't it beautiful? I love this little flower down the bottom here. It's got a real vintage look to it, hasn't it? And that's a felted heart and it's it's like a lace collage. And I don't think I've seen this, Michelle, so that's lovely. I do like that. And you know, I'll probably look back and be able to read it just like that. But as often happens, you have these mental little blanks when you're recording. Oh, look, and there's another little pink one up the top there. Inside of this little piece, I think that must have come off a doily or something. It's really pretty, isn't it? Thank you so much. That's beautiful. And then we have a banner. Oh, isn't that sweet? It's a, it's a mitten banner. Oh, look at the pictures. Aren't they pretty? And that's 
Oh, okay, that's like a little loop that I can hang that up with. Like that. Oh, that's so pretty. And I think this may be on her channel also. It's so pretty. It's it's like fabric and then she's got this quilted wadding and she's gone all around it with this lovely trim and this gorgeous applique piece with the sequins in it and then she's framed the images with some doily off cuts she's put these lovely seam binding bows at the top there some lovely crochet trim look at the little images aren't they sweet and it says let it snow and on the middle one here she has this little dangle of a pair of skates that's so pretty thank you so much for that oh look I didn't see that that's got it's like a little um, plastic kind of snowflake trim and then these see we don't get things like this over here these are lovely aren't they these um, those snowflakes here they're like acrylic I think or plastic they're um they're nice we don't I haven't seen those over here at all that's beautiful thank you for that Michelle I'm thinking that might be my surprise gift that's lovely thank you I'll just pop that over there and I see a book in here oh my goodness but I'm going to leave that till last so I can give it all the attention that it needs and I think I have a little pink cushion here look at this isn't that sweet isn't that sweet and if anything in here is centered um, forgive me if I don't comment because ever since I got really sick a month or two ago I've lost my sense of smell so I can't smell anything um, which is really annoying so if if anything I'm not saying it is centered but just in case I don't comment if something is that is why and I'm hoping it comes back very soon but that isn't that lovely made out of a, a, a doily or is you wouldn't have made unless you crochet do you crochet Michelle isn't that sweet? That's lovely, thank you. And then we have, isn't this beautiful? It's like a, a lingerie bag made out of satin. And it's got these lovely applique pieces on it. It's ever so soft, so the satin feels quite old with these lovely strings. And inside we have have a few goodies by the look of it. Isn't that a beautiful bag? I love things like that. We have, is that tea or, it's almost a shame to open them isn't it? <laughs> look how pretty they are. Uh, but I will. Look at that, isn't that pretty? Oh, I'm gathering their tea bags. Are they tea? Oh, should I open them? Oh, I don't want to ruin anything. I'm thinking it's tea. It's got something inside of it. Oh, I don't want to ruin anything. Oh, look at that. It's because I it, it's going to rip. Oh, I wonder if I can just. I can always stick it back together if I'm doing the wrong thing, can't I? Oh, don't you hate it when you're not quite sure what to do? Yes, it's a tea bag. Okay, okay, okay. I'll just do this one. Whew. <laughs> and we have herbal teas inside of it. Isn't that lovely? Thank you so much. And they're ever so pretty. Aren't they just lovely? Oh, they're so pretty. I should do something like like that for my um, for my mum. They do an afternoon, a morning tea once a month at different places. And 
And maybe I'll do one of those for her one day. Bella! And in here we have and it's all packaged so prettily Michelle thank you for that oh isn't that lovely she's made a doily flower look at this in the center isn't that gorgeous oh that is stunning that piece and it's just lots and lots and lots of doilies, the medallions of the doilies. I love that. It's beautiful. I love this centerpiece. It's just gorgeous. Thank you, Michelle. And I think we have another flower here. Yes, we have another doily flower here, and that's got a metal centerpiece with a leaf on the side of it as well. That's lovely. You know, I use things like this to put on top of my jars and things like that. Flowers that people have sent me. That's beautiful. Thank you. And what do we have here? I wonder what this is. I don't have that colour seam binding, you know. Look at that. Oh, is this another banner? Or is it a book? It says to and from. Bella. Shh. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I love this glitter stuff you're using. Oh, that is pretty, isn't it? It's ever so subtle. Oh, it's a tag. Is it a, a tag book or something? Oh, no. Are these... Oh, are these those tags from that lady? Oh, aren't they beautiful? Oh, aren't they just beautiful? Isn't it lovely? Look at that. Can you... It's, got a, it's in a little bag, actually. So, Bella, look at the sparkle. I hope... The light is picking that up. Just let me put my cat out for a moment, please. Okay, sorry about that. Oh, aren't they just beautiful? I've seen these tags, I think, unless Michelle made them herself. Um, a lady does these most gorgeous tags. And they have the glitter on them. Aren't they beautiful? I love this tag holder you've made. It's very nice, isn't it? This is lovely because I don't have tags. If I have, if I got to use tags, I've got to make them there and then. <laughs> I barely ever have spare tags lying around. Oh, look at this. Oh, they're so pretty. I wouldn't want to use them. They're beautiful. Oh, aren't they pretty? Thank you so much, Michelle. Look at that one. Very lovely. And this tag holder, isn't that clever? That is really nice and I don't think I've seen... I'm, I may have, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Isn't that pretty? It's just like folded up and sewn. And it keeps everything... And check now how does it fold up like that like that and then it ties together again that's lovely Michelle thank you and I'll just I'll just wrap that there these videos get quite long don't they and then I like this bag, it's got a crown on it. Can you see the bag? The crown, the gold crown, isn't that lovely? I do like that. And in here we have, oh we have some charms. Peace, love, angel. And some little 
gold ones. Oh, isn't that pretty? It's got like a mother of pearl effect on it. Very pretty. Thank you so much. Oh, aren't they nice? Oh, I like those. I do like those. They're only sure I haven't. Aren't they nice? Oh, dangly charms. Thank you, Michelle. That's lovely of you. Very kind of you to share those with me. And now I am going to move all these things over a little bit because we have a very beautiful album to have a look through. And by the looks of it, it's a large album, so I need a bit of space. Here we go. All right, so we had agreed to make, oh gosh, a fab. I hope I have enough space for the camera to fit all this in. It looks gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Oh, sorry. Look at this. We agreed to make each other a fabric lace album. It was to be no bigger than an A4 size, you know, just to try and keep things down. But we know they always grow. And I've just written down here what... Okay, so no bigger than A4 when it's finished. Um, it was to have six pages all together. That was including internal pages. And Michelle wanted... Oh, I won't tell you what Michelle wanted for hers because I'll tell you that when I actually... Um, show you the album I've made for her but I wanted to have cottages with cottage gardens English cottages and cottage gardens that kind of theme um, and that's what Michelle was making for me and look at this so that's the top and I'm going sorry about putting it on its side bit but look at this oh, it's the bottom look at this hanger like a door hanger Thing. Isn't that a wonderful idea? I love, love, love that. It's like an, a knocker for that, like on the picture here. And she's got the door on the front of the album. Oh, I hope you do a video on this, Michelle, so you can explain it in greater detail. And we have a beautiful, I think, marabou feather in the corner there. And it never even got squashed. Isn't that wonderful? We have a handmade flower, fabric flower here with a jeweled center. Lots of laces and trims all the way around. This gorgeous image of a front door. And I love this little swag going across the top of it here. And, a, oh, and some tatting in this corner. Another flower with a dangle. And look, it's got a, a little key down here. Because of course you need a key to get in the door, don't you? And we've got this knocker. And I, I love that. Reminds me of an art cake or something. It's really lovely and it's 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 just really nice. I love that. Thank you for putting that on there, Michelle. That's really beautiful. And there's the spine. We have this gorgeous crisscross lace trim down the back. This the spine of the book, and that's the back of the book. Oh, look at this. Uh, home. Home sweet sweet home. There's no no place like home. Isn't that beautiful? And the birds and the doilies, the vintage doilies and everything, just layered upon layer. We have another flower down the bottom corner here with a a bling center. What a pretty center that is. Look at this trip down there. Okay, let's get started, shall we? so much to look at and all these lovely layers down the bottom here look we've got all these layers down the bottom and there's some more i've got my camera as far up as it will go um hoping that it would fit but i can't sort of get it any further so hopefully we will manage this so here's the first page Wow, look at that, just let me take it in, oh look at the image, isn't it beautiful, oh I love that, oh look, oh. And it's got a cherub on the window there, isn't this lovely, 
I love this trim that goes all the way around and the beautiful wedding applique up this up this side here can you see that applique with some doilies underneath just ever so soft colors she's used because we agreed we weren't going to use any bright colors um, you know dusty kind of colors are quite all right in there. and there's like there's quite a few layers of the doilies here very very lovely Michelle thank you so much look at the beautiful cottage isn't it pretty and then we have the window isn't that lovely what a fun theme see now I want to go and make a cottage one myself <laughs> it's just beautiful and we have lots of doilies hanging down the bottom here as well see down there and there's the top and we have this lace the rosette trim down the side and some applique here and then on have I missed anything there's some tatting in the window I'm trying to see oh okay she's it's a garden behind the is it a window or a like an archway in the garden I'd say it's a window it looks like a window doesn't it and I think it's such a clever way to do it I really do and then on to our next double pages and we have another lovely image of a cottage here with some flowers in the corner here and this looks like a bow doesn't it made out of doilies in our jewel center some more wedding applique and flowers I love this bit here isn't that pretty I, that's really pretty love the the rhinestones in it it's very pretty isn't it and another picture of a, uh, a garden seat oh how lovely very nice and little one of those doily center things there more applicators look at this um i think it might be like a old tablecloth or serviette or even a doily perhaps and it's got the um it's got the embroidery on it like it's a bubbled embroidery um, what a good way to use up those pattern doilies and things uh, to use it in a garden theme what a clever idea that is and more tassel laces down the bottom here is isn't that pretty look I do like that one it's really pretty very soft very nice. Oh, look at that piece there. And more doilies underneath as well. Wow. And some ruffled laces all around the edge. See, when you're looking at it through the camera's view, you see things instantly. When you're actually looking at it um, in real life, you're taking a bit in at a time. Um, and some more ruffled laces up the top here as well. That's lovely. Is that part of that applique or did you put that on separately? It's really pretty. The pearl trim. I love the images you've chosen as well. Very nice. And then our last page. Oh, look at the wedding appliques. Aren't they gorgeous? Look at that love it so so pretty and we have some more garden themes here look at the flowers on the cottages how beautiful is that oh Michelle you've done a lovely job such a lovely job it's really really pretty isn't it and then she's she's got a pocket on the last page and she's got a little cushion inside oh isn't that nice it's the back of the cushion isn't that beautiful that's really lovely isn't it and on the front she's got home sweet home isn't that beautiful and there's a little oh what's this oh and she's got a key <laughs> that goes in there as well so let's just pop those back in. What a good idea that is. And then we have this lovely picture here of the cottage. 
and some more wedding apple oops out of shot sorry um, some more wedding applique down the bottom here on this part here that's really really beautiful Michelle wow just taking it all in look at this delicate little trim she's used all around the pictures I really hope you do a video on it so you can explain it so much better because I know when I watch it back I'll probably see things that I never commented on because it's hard to take it all in but that's really lovely and you've used a doily for your frame here that's beautiful and then we go to our back back cover again and once again this gorgeous trim down the side there isn't that ever so pretty it really is and I hope you've put your name on it somewhere but I know it's from you anyway so that's okay and lovely trims across the top wow that's really wonderful you put a lot of work into that and I really do appreciate it Michelle I really do and I've I am thoroughly enjoying putting yours together for you as well. Um, it's almost done. It's almost done. Um, and Because we originally said that we would send at the end of August. So I'm not late. <laughs> Although I feel like I am. I'm not. <laughs> oh dear. We're funny, aren't we? Um, so thank you so much for that Michelle it's absolutely gorgeous and thank you for the needle book and your other special little gifts that you've sent as well all the beautiful hand work that you've done and isn't it special to receive someone's handiwork it really really is and I do appreciate it it was a lovely idea to do a swap um, sometimes we forget to just have fun don't we sometimes when you know we get caught up in other things and it's lovely just to make something for someone so thank you and thank you everybody for joining me today and before I go again sorry I just wanted to show you this absolutely beautiful runner that Michelle wrapped everything in isn't isn't it beautiful look at it look at the work on that it's just beautiful and it's it's really it's really really long look at that and it's oh it's so beautiful that is that's so precious thank you very much for that Michelle I will treasure that I really will it's absolutely beautiful so thank you for that also okay take care bye bye